Welcome back to Temptation in round three now. Corey with the advantage over our champ. Here come the questions. Which meeting between heads of government is also the highest point of a hill or mountain? Richard. Summon. Here comes the champ. The cable guy and Zoolander were both, Corey. Ben Stiller. Yeah, both directed by him. Which extends further north, the Republic of Ireland or Northern Ireland? Corey. Republic of Ireland. Republic is right. And Bob's opening up for you, Corey. 25 in the clear over Richard. 15 is the transaction we must make. Came for some cash? He's a student. Of course he is. Let's dive in. Get you some uh, rewards here. 88. 388. And something nice. Okay. Huh. Corey. Thanks. <laughs> I'm going to bump it up to 400. <laughs> Because that's nicer and rounder, all right? And you yeah. got a couple of dollars there in the last gift shop. Back to the questions. Leading Germany's successful bid to host the 2006 Soccer World Cup was former playing great Franz who? Franz Beckenbauer. Which group famously played its last live commercial concert at Candlestick Park, San Francisco, on August 29? Richard? Beatles? Yeah, back in 1966. From 2001 to 2006, when he suffered a massive stroke, Ariel Sharon was Prime Minister Richard Israel. He's good, the champ. A share of the lead and $25 now into play. It's behind one of our famous faces. Who am I? Born in Wyoming in 1912 and dying in 1956, I grew up in Arizona and California and studied at Los Angeles Manual Arts High School. In 1930, I joined my brother in New York where we both studied under Thomas Hart Benton at the Arts Students League. In 49, I gained fame after a four-page spread in Life magazine suggested I was the greatest living painter in the US. But during the early 50s, my struggle with alcoholism. Richard? Jackson Pollock. Jackson Pollock is right. Over $40 million, his amazing blue poles, which uh, the Australian government purchased back in the 70s. Richard, could be a game-breaker. What are you going for? Um, I'll go for Tracy Grimshaw. Here comes Trace from ACA. The burglar. Wonder where you're looking to score $5. Leanne, 35. You're level with Corey on 55. Corey? Big surprise. <laughs> we do a little transaction here. Richard now leads by $10. Where was the money hiding tonight? Appropriately, the wild card was with Pink. Gary Jordan uncovered the $15 and Toby Maguire had the $25. Big turnaround in round three. Appropriately, Pink was the wild one, but can our champ hang on? He hits the lead for the first time tonight. The minute that matters. Coming up next, this will sort it out.